and today I'm back with Mix Daily Training with Fritz 18. Yep, let's have fun and let's go. Alright, let's go to tactics. Let's just solve tactic. Okay. Wait. Might be five. Ridiculous. Ridiculously easy, ridiculous hard. Year night seven is important, so rookie six, mate. Yeah, because usually ridiculous sounds like it's something crazy hard, you know. Rook g2. Mm. Queen g5, king e5, queen e2, take stakes, h2, should be good, I guess so. Was G five okay? Oops, knight here, knight. Mm. Rookie four and and twenty four, I guess. Oh no, here I take only four and play twenty four and then take only four. Nice. Uh, Rook B eight. This is twenty three. Rook B eight. I have five. It's interesting. B6, take sticks, knight c5. Okay. <coughs> okay. He didn't want to continue the puzzle. Rook up 2, rook up 2. Rook f2, if he takes back, rook f2. Hmm. Not sure. Rook f2. Rook f2. Rook f2, rook f2. <laughs> um, okay, bishop f2, rook f2, rook d1, king g2. That looks good. Then rook d1, then here, then queen c5, then queen f5, and then basically rook hangs. But here I think I need g5. <gasps> you are blind today? <laughs> okay, it was e3 and that. Okay. <laughs> Yikes. Mm -hmm. Bishop e3, of take c, queen g3, bishop e3. Um, yeah, now just queen g3. Uh, that's good and nice. What's here? Some sort of queen tag is interesting to consider. But also bishop e6. With bishop d7 and d8 interest, and if f takes c, I take queen e6. Then bishop e7, like I play bishop g7, or rook d7, or queen d7. Mm-hmm. Bam. Queen a4, bishop 6. Bishop a6 is weird but interesting. Bishop a6, queen f3. If rook a6. I kinda don't know. <laughs> um. 
Um, ah, I really don't see anything, which is good. That's not so good. <laughs> yeah. I see nothing. I mean, I see a lot of stuff, but I see nothing which I think can be good. Oh. G6? I mean, maybe. I have no idea at all. Hmm. 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 <laughs> well, yeah, that's actually quite hard. I mean, these three is interesting. I don't know. I'll just go for it. Wait, and here. I mean, okay, there should be three. Yeah, I mean, I didn't see the continuation here. Mm. <laughs> A five? Ah, I didn't see that. Oh, that seems quite hard. Um, six, give me six. Or just play rookie one. <laughs> um, I think I will just do it. <laughs> okay. Like to move and win. I hope that will be a bit less hard than previous puzzle. <laughs> but we'll have to see. Uh huh. From first look, doesn't look so easy, you know. <laughs> um, 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 um. I mean, just rook c4. Oh wow, I'm so so good at solving puzzles today. Wait, and then e three. I mean, yeah, first move is easy to find, but then continuation is not so simple to find. Uh huh. Okay. Poof. Um g four, nine g four, I mean nine g four. I mean yeah, here it is uh like move which I see is the same rating but there is no like super hard move after, so it is quite easy to solve. Okay, here and then I do wait, what did I do? What did I do? I don't know. Uh here or knight g4 or bishop g3 looks very good. I think maybe bishop g3. <laughs> I don't know, I have no idea. I'm so, 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 and so in puzzles today. Yikes. Uh huh. 1177. Oops. I kind of don't see the solution. I mean, rookie 2. Falling quite a bit today. E7, King G8. He takes D, that's good. E7, King E8. He takes D. Wait. What? E7, King G8, he takes D. Takes with Knight, I take on D6. Takes with the Rook, I should win. If he plays King E8, if he takes D. Knight one. It was mate in one. 
Okay, but yeah, my move is winning. <laughs> Meeting one. Oh, that's so funny. Okay, knight g7 here looks quite good. Knight g7, queen e5, bishop c7. Hold on. Yeah, continue. Queen h6. Knight e6, bishop h3, probably. Yeah, okay. Oh, master level, okay. <laughs> Couldn't solve tough puzzles. I'm quite scared what is going to be at master level. Oy, oy, oy. Uh, rook eb1 with rook c8 idea is interesting. Though he can just go for king e7, and I'm not sure. What if bishop d6? Rook c8 immediately, that looks good. Ooh, nice, it's all master level, let's go. And now we're saying bishop d6, right? Important in between, yep. Let's go. Uh, very difficult. Very difficult puzzle. Okay. I think it is not difficult. At least I hope so. <laughs> um. Ninety four and basically rook g eight. Mm hmm. Ninety four. Still rook g eight, I think, is quite good. Mm hmm. I can go for knight. I can't go for knight six. No, queen seven no. Rook f five. <clears throat> Mm, okay, okay, I think it's quite, I mean, not super good, but quite decent, you know, quite decent. Oh, well, meanwhile, uh oh, nightmare, uh oh, <laughs> okay, let's try to solve it. 96, and da da da. I mean, 96, in my opinion, should be extremely strong. Nice. But then rook f6. Okay. Okay, let's think. Uh huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Ba ba Queen g two. Just calm. Yeah, just stay calm and then bishop f five and then both both of the bishops are hanging and one of them is going to fall. Cool. Another nightmare. The last one wasn't so nightmare even though I failed it. It was quite quite interesting. Mm -hmm. Hold on, knight d6, he takes d queen b6. Get it? Should not be a huge problem, but I'm not sure what. Um, <clears throat> if this is this, if that, rook c1. Yeah. Um, Um, I don't see it. <sighs> mm, I'm 
Hey, Chara. Hey, I mean, I wanted this. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. And a5. Queen a6, knight six. There, I mean, gotta be some compensation at least. Gotta be some. Some is word, I guess. Rook d6, rook d6, rook d6, rook d6, and rook d6, yeah. <laughs> uh, no, we just take with the pawn, nice. Okay, and if c takes d, I would have queen b6, queen 6, that should be winning. Uh, okay, black to move and win. What have I done? But okay. Uh, let's see. Queen g3. <coughs> queen g4. Queen g3. Queen c3. Queen g2. Queen g3. Knight 6. Knight g4. Now wait. Knight g4 doesn't think. I don't think it is good because he can just take. Basically. <laughs> If bishop e4 now, queen c3, b4, queen b4, queen g3. Ah, huh. that's interesting. <laughs> Maybe it was interesting, but definitely not correct. I don't know. No one accepts on play chess. That's. Ooh, only said it and play against Pena Choto. Look, look. Yeah, I don't know about that puzzle. <laughs> um, D6. A6. Feel free to play. Nah, nothing, I guess. I mean, knight f3, b5, bishop b3. That would be quite helpful. Okay, this I'll go for b5. Okay, bishop b2, it doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't fall for the trap, but e5 is quite interesting and kind of weird move, in my opinion. Because I'm pretty sure he just gave away the pawn, didn't he? C takes d. This knight e5 is possible, queen e5 is also possible. Maybe go for queen e5, I think. Maybe a bit better. But yeah, interesting move. To like sack a pawn for some good compensation. Let's see. Interesting. Pretty sure he's going to take on six. Oh uh, no, okay. I'm pretty sure now I have quite big advantage. <coughs> Like 1.5 or something like this, at least. Because <clears throat> knight 6 would make my pawn structure not so good. Okay, I mean, yeah, I'm developing. Developing. Not developing. Uh, knight f6. <clears throat> okay. Then bishop b7, then castle, then bishop b7, like that. <coughs> Here, bishop. Ooh, we almost born clouded. <laughs> okay, that would not be super cool, but fun for content, I guess. <coughs> okay. Here, bishop b7. Yeah, I think 94 is kind of time waste. <coughs> kind of. I'm not scared of knight b5 twice, because basically just won't be able to end the attack. So I'm pretty sure I'm quite better. Okay, here, castle. Mm -hmm. <coughs> kind of done with my development, I'm pretty sure I can say. <coughs> Mm 
keep a4 let's go for b4 just like attacking his knight to see where he's going to play where is he going to bring put this knight Mm -hmm. This hmm. let's go for knight e4. Just try out move order because knight e4 basically can be the same. <clears throat> so if he takes with a queen now, <clears throat> yeah, okay. A knight of six, oh, that's also, yeah, maybe even a bit better for him. Not sure. Number should be seven. Yes. Yeah. Uh interesting. <laughs> not the scene, not the way. I thought he will do the stuff, but <clears throat> I think it is quite good for him also. So I think he's going to take on d4. I'm going to take, he's going to play queen d4, I'll play d5. And then idea to play rook a c8 and double up on c rank, like rook c4 and then rook f c8. That looks quite good, I guess. <clears throat> okay. Let's try to do it. Okay. Okay, that I'm going to go for rook a c8. Just as in my plan. Okay. This I think maybe rook c4 is like not so safe, but at least I get like more space. That's yeah, that's what I want. Mm-hmm. Here rook c3. Okay. Yeah, that, um, <clears throat> rook fc8, okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure he is going, it's likely that he's going to take and unplay rook c1, and yeah, basically position is going to be like, I have a pawn, I have more space, but seems like he's holding. And I need to find a way. Oh, okay, he plays rook c1 immediately. Mm, that's interesting. I think I'll play a5. Just what I was planning after rook 3, rook 3. To have even more space, and just so his queen cannot touch my pawn. Uh huh. Okay. Rook c3, yeah, so basically kind of as planned. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. I'll play queen c7, I think. Just to not be so aggressive. Yeah, that's quite interesting. <laughs> um, then rook e2, I think, or rook c1. I guess it is logical to go for e2, but I'm not sure. Oh, ah, that's a nice trap. I need queen c6 then, I guess. Uh, but okay, let's go for rook c2. Wait, should, should I? Yeah, queen c6, I would not have that. Nice trap. Pena, Chioto, GG. Um, though, though, though. I have quite, not quite super scary, at least, yeah, probably c2 pawn is going to fail, so it will be like, uh, <clears throat> it'll still be a pawn up, only position is going to be a bit more open. Yeah, that, I was, I, I was prepared that it will be a check in h7. No, hold on, if rookie 2, I cannot actually take on c2, because... 
I'll just have Queen E4 win the rook. <laughs> okay, Queen E4 immediately. Maybe I need a G6. I'm not sure. This feels like, yeah, he's, he's saving the pawn. I need to find a way how to sneak in to win. Okay, no, he doesn't want to save the pawn. He goes for H4. Wow. That's interesting. Mm hmm. So she basically wants to, 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 to do some problems for me. Maybe queen c5? But then he has like rook e2, so I guess h5 by my own. Uh, then you go for rook e2, I'm pretty sure. Because why would she just want to give away the pawn? <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, rook c5, just trying to, to find some weakness of him. I'm not sure if there is any. Yeah, yeah queen c7 was a mistake. Which threw the advantage and now position is very equal and I'm not sure how to win it. <laughs> okay. Let's go for rook d5. Yeah, and if I would play g6 after queen d5. Still think it would be better because h6 I just allowed him to to yeah to get nice position. Um I don't know. King g7 just to make a move. Because I kinda not sure how to win. So yeah. Is he plan to go for g4? <laughs> Maybe. Um, <laughs> Queen D8 just basically preventing G4 because if G4 I'll just take on H4. <laughs> yeah, that's the idea. Because like Queen D6 you could still go for G4. Okay, Queen E3. <clears throat> um, Queen F6. Just to make a move. Just a move to make a move. <laughs> logical? Yes, quite logical. <clears throat> this. Okay. I kind of don't see what he's planning to go for. What he's planning to do. So... Now, no, it does not mean that I'll go crazy winning, trying to win everything, but I'll just go back and forth, trying to understand what he wants. Okay, he also goes back and forth. Oh, uh, poo, 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 poo. I want to really queen a1 and rook d1. Yeah, let's play queen a1. Maybe rook d1 after. What? <coughs> Okay, just let's see, okay, it goes for rook e1. I can go for rook d1, but I think I'll go for queen b2. Okay, uh, <sighs> you go queen b1. It's only what I noticed now. And you can go for rook e1, because I'll have queen c2. <laughs> yeah. I need to be careful. You can, like, go inside my camp like rook d2 and try to break through. That's true. <laughs> okay, queen f4. Yeah, that's what I'm kind of talking about. Okay, king g7. I think it is kind of good that he kind of wastes time, because he's in some trouble. So every second he sings can be decisive later on. The game. Okay. It's a one and a half minute. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Whoa, he sold for 35 seconds. That's a lot. Um, <clears throat> I can just go like King G8, you know? I think I won't lose if I'll go back and forth. Uh, now idea Rook G1 is a bit more clear, I think. Okay, Queen G1. Oi, oi. If I go Rook G1... <clears throat> I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I can go for Queen B2 also. Um, definitely I won't go for a Queen trade, I think. Yeah, <laughs> because it make it will make position much easier for him. Uh, okay, rook d1. If something, I can go back to d5, of course. <clears throat> Keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. It's less than a minute on the clock. Queen e7, rook h1 with queen f1 threat. Uh, rook h1 if queen f2 preventing queen f1 I can just go for like rook c1 and I don't know what afterwards but let's go for rook h1 creating problems queen f2 is very likely I think because if rook f2 just queen g1 um, yeah it sinks for a while <coughs> yes yeah, this I guess I can just go for like in h7, checking what c is going to do. <coughs> and probably I'll win time in equal position, I think. <laughs> rook e5, that's interesting. Uh, then I'll go for rook c1. Rook e2. Turn nine eight no rook c five okay. I'll go for queen b two I guess. Seven six five four three. <laughs> okay, GG. That was quite our showing, but what the penachioto. Good game. I I mean yeah, okay, I was completely winning, I'm pretty sure but but yeah, then 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 I decided to blunder and almost draw a good game smile Sang smile Yep Um I don't know, let's solve this puzzle. Bishop F three, but then he has rookie two. Uh, knight e4? Yeah. Knight g4 doesn't look good <laughs> at all. Um, I don't just take the knight? <laughs> no. <clears throat> um, I have no idea, so you know. Uh, 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 uh. And I have no idea which I tried, which move I tried already, and which I didn't. No, 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 no. <laughs> I don't know. Everything, but I, I didn't. I guess G five. That's crazy puzzle. <laughs> crazy hard puzzle. Okay, and Queen G three. How? I don't know why, but I somehow didn't try it yet. Okay, I was like ninety nine percent sure it was before the game the move I tried, but <laughs> as it seems, it wasn't. You know. Okay, counter. No, wait. Mm -hmm. Alright, so basically, <clears throat> he played weird openings and he played extremely well but quite slow. <clears throat> and then he was panicking in time trouble and he lost. D5 mistake, he had to go for like, I don't know, Bishop B3 or D3. Uh, and that's equal B5, this, this. 
Yeah, d4 was another mistake you had to go for. Oh no, wait, not queen 7, it's a mistake. d4 is a mistake you had to go for castle. Uh, and then if knight e5, knight e5, this bishop f3, and that's draw. That's not good. So basically, castle, bishop b7, rook e1, bishop e7. Not better, but still, not on material, at least. 25 mistake, I had to go for 95. Yeah, makes sense. Because that's what I said during game. That's a mistake, I had to go for 96. Uh, and then basically, d takes c, like g3 or castle, and he has compensation. Yeah, kind of. That's literally what I said. Um, these, these. Here, 92 was interesting. Yeah, I, I thought about 92, but I was kind of worried, so I didn't go for it. This, I'm like plus 3. That, I'm completely winning. Weaker is, we take C, yeah, this. Rookie 1, that first mistake, I just had to go for like queen 6. And yeah, not, no problems, he'll go for rook here. Then h6, h4, queen c5, and slowly but surely I'm winning. And yeah, queen d5, best move for him. Uh, then h6 is a mistake, I had to go for g6, queen 8, king g7, and I'm better because the pawn is falling, basically. So queen 8, this, and then he found the draw, and I don't know, it was hard for me to win. I tried my best, but, but, yeah. But basically, it was the row here, and that's a blunder in terms trouble. He had to go for a 7 and draw. And after she takes H one time, and one day, Penat shot up. Good game. That was quite interesting game. <laughs> yeah. The Lundi chess base freeze, it seems likely. But okay, should we go now? Um, let's take this game on two games and play chess. Mm -hmm. 59, cool. Oh, uh, now let's go and play in Fritz in easy game. I think I am going to play with white pieces this game and no hints and good luck. Ooh, that's interesting. <coughs> H3. White is slightly better. In my opinion, it is quite unusual uh, for black to play like b6, c6, d6, c6, c6, b6. No, oh, I'm better. Uh, he just hung a pawn, didn't he? And then 85. I'm clearly better. Already plus 2. Let's go. I'm better. Not plus 2. I think I'm going to take on d7. Um, then I don't know. Hmm. What can I play? I mean, f3? I mean, maybe not the best move, but interesting. Because basically, for pawn is a weakness, and take I didn't see other moves, which would be better than that. So <laughs> that's why I went for f3. Okay, a3. I'm better, but not clearly better. So look, a c8 from him. I can play like queen a4, then my knight. Let's three may hang. Maybe let's just put my king away from this diagonal, from g1, a7 diagonal. Uh, if he'll play c5, he'll just play knight b5, I'm winning. So, yeah, he's calculating about bishop, he's thinking about bishop e5. That's interesting. He goes for rook cd8. I'm just slightly better here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Seems I lost the advantage. Okay, bishop d4. I'm just slightly better. Okay. <laughs> Yes, you can see here my pieces are not super well coordinated. His pieces are like all perfectly green. My are some mine are there are even some yellow ones. Okay, rook d1. I mean barely yellow. <laughs> yeah. That is like some sort of lime. Okay, now I'm better. Um and queen d1, queen d7. Queen e1, queen g5, queen g7, knight f4, bishop f1. Uh, I mean queen d1. Slightly better. Just didn't see the advantage. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think I have dark square weakness. Luckily, it doesn't have dark square bishop to go inside. 
and feel my weakness. So I'll just play bishop f1 to have my bishop at like kind of safe square, I guess, which is also guarding. Knight f4. I think here queen d7 is the move he wants me to play. Well, I guess he doesn't want me to play it, but would be better because I kind of don't see any better move. I mean, knight e2 is interesting, but then like after knight e6, I have like no idea how to get more advantage. So queen d7 is the move I'm going to go for. Yeah, okay, knight g6, but I'm pretty sure he may try knight h5. No, knight g6, okay. Don't see the point, but <laughs> I'm not afraid, so I can't know the point. C5, we take C. Now that doesn't look super good. Um, hold on. Tell CCD is probably or like or 95 or something else. I can play A4. I guess it won't hurt. Just slightly better, but I don't know. I just I'm feeling my pawn up. That's what I feel. I don't feel anything else. Okay. I really want to consider 85 now, uh, because it seems quite good that, yeah, basically a huge, huge cool scene. But I'm not so sure if I'm better, because there, it, with my bishop, were literally all my all of my pawns are light square. My light square bishop maybe won't be so good there, so I definitely need to think of if I should play 95 or no. Um, I mean, they definitely shouldn't, but I think I will try it. No, I'm just slightly better. Uh, I, I, I just can't feel the advantage. In, but okay, I'm better. Yeah, I'm slightly better. I, as I already said, I just cannot feel the advantage. Queen c7 is interesting move, forcing him to trade queens, and then his knight can go inside my camp. Though, <clears throat> literally all of my pawns are kind of well protected, so I think it shouldn't be that scary. I mean, queen e7 is also candidate move, <clears throat> but queen 7 knight 7 this bishop c6, or knight c6, knight d4, and then bishop c6, and then my a4 pawn may be a weakness, so that's a bit worrying, uh, but I think I'm going to play queen e7. Yeah, I don't see it, so I'm just slightly better. Ooh, okay, here knight 7 is an interesting move. Uh, knight c7, or maybe queen c7 now is a bit better, because basically queen 7, bishop 7, takes 6, knight 7, then bishop c6, b3, can go to d4, but I kind of need a bishop on d1 to protect. Oof. The, it feels so far that the game is like up and down, I mean up, I have advantage and down to draw, but uh, I kind of cannot feel the advantage when I have it. A5 is an interesting move, because I think A5 is a weakness, as you can see. B2 pawn is a weakness, and A4 pawn is a weakness. And A5 is getting rid of that pawn, and if you go for knight c6, then queen c7. And there, queen trade is good, because I'm getting rid of my weakness. So let's go for A5. Yeah, knight 6, queen 7, and then it takes B. Or if it takes takes, just say takes B. Clearly better. I think queen c7 is a move he really, really, really wants me to find. No. But okay, I guess he doesn't want me to find it. But I found it. My bishop, as you can see, is yellow. His bishop, his queen, and his king are not so good. Okay, this. Hold on. 95, okay. Um, so basically, I think takes is a move. A takes B. And then maybe knight a6, b4. Maybe, I'm not sure. Knight d5, bishop d5, c takes d. Can't feel the advantage again. My bishop is not so good. So why I want like knight a6, b4? Because it feels like my bishop is getting better there. I don't know. Mm. d5 there, this. Can I fit? He has some chance of promoting. I mean, okay, it takes b. Clearly better. How? <laughs> How am I clearly better? Uh, does he really want me to find 95? I mean, 95 takes takes. 95 bishop b5 and d6 f4 e5. That looks interesting. It's better maybe. Right. He says it's right. Oh well, c takes d of course, because <laughs> otherwise my bishop would be not so good. Um, I mean d6. Slide in new. Oh yes, f4 
e5, f4, e5. Yeah, that's basically what I was planning, but it's, as he said, probably it was in the right move order. Okay, g3, yeah, I need to defend that pawn, f6, of course, but basically bishop b5, and he's in some sort of a zugzwang. Oi, 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 he needs knight f7. Oh, wow, maybe I'll play bishop c4 just to make him smile. <laughs> we'll see. Um, because e5, f takes c, f takes c, knight f7, and then e5 hangs, and you d7, king e7. Bishop c4, knight, I mean, king e8, then e5 is very interesting to try. Yeah, so bishop c4, uh, that, okay. If I take on f7, takes, then e5. Shouldn't that be winning? So takes, takes, e5, b5, can here, can that, 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 c3, c3, c3. Mm -hmm. I mean, okay, I'm going to take e5, of course. I'm just slightly better. Oh, no, now, now I'm better. Okay, he's up and down. Can g2, b4. King f3, b3, king e2, c4, king g2, c4, king f3, b4, king e4, king e3. Yeah, that should be good. Slightly better. <laughs> and now I'm clearly better. Decisive advantage. So basically just g4 or go king f3. Think you won't create problems on that side and king f3 b4 f b3 c4 no we don't have b3 i think hold on this this king d2 maybe i do have b3 no king f3 b4 king e4 c4 king d4 i mean i have it okay king f3 clearly i have decisive advantage i mean king e4 isn't something needed but maybe just g4 not sure um not sure not sure King e4, this is, this, then play b3, c4, that's winning, and that, that's winning. Let's go for d4. Wait, I don't have decisive advantage? <laughs> How? Uh, I don't know. I'm clearly better, so I'm like plus two. Though I feel like I'm winning, winning. Okay. Yeah, my pawn structure, pawn on e5 is super weak, but he cannot take it. Uh, I mean, here b3, c4. King e3, c3, that's a draw. B, c4, this. So, I think king e4 and king d3, king c4 is an idea. If he goes for c4 by his own, I have king d4. And then if c3, I take. B3, king d3, then c4, and I should be win. So just king e4. Uh, B3, king d3, and then king c4. Okay, this. Now we go king d4. This I go b takes c, only good move. Then I take, and that should be winning. Nice. Now king d4, king here, go to f5, let's play e6, let's go to g6, let's go to f7, let's go to e7. Where's my pawn here? Out a queen. King g6, king h6, king g5, h4, h. And thank you, Fritzess. It's a fantastic game. Thanks for the game. That was very. I really liked it. You gave up. Uh, good game. That was so cool. Enter and analyze. Let's analyze it. Maybe no puzzles today. I mean, one puzzle I got myself. I got an a nice note. So, okay, infinite analysis. Okay, so opening was quite good, not quite extremely good. This, this, here, yeah, that was like a miss, an inaccuracy. You had to go for like bishop f8, d5, c takes d, this, and I'm slightly better. But okay, I didn't feel the advantage, even though it says I'm like, okay, f4, aha, uh -huh, makes sense. So basically, f4 would have been better, just to get more space, makes sense, I see. Bishop f6 this. I have like 0 0.5 advantage. 
barely have the advantage. C5 was interesting here. Again, C5. But in C8, knight d5 is. That bishop a8. Here I found a5. That's like an inaccuracy. Probably knight c6. And queen c7. Just ignore, right? So basically, this I met that. And then, like. I mean, it's fine. Um, it's equal. Yes, that's the best pawn structure now. Okay, queen 7 trade, queen bishop 6 sees these, knight d5, that. Uh, here d6, that's a mistake. Okay, I have to go for king g1, and basically king e7, king f2, king d6, bishop c4, and that's like I'm better. Uh, knight d5 mistakes from him, mistake, he had to go for f6, then g3, basically knight e5. And then I can stop his time go to f7 and then bye bye to my pawn and that's equal. So basically f4 is the best move. Uh, knight g6, g3, f6, which should be 5. I try to prevent his king. Uh, this knight f7 takes, takes e5, b5, king g2, this, this, and I'm winning. How is not I winning here? That's like a mistake. You have to go for f5. But I'm winning. Yeah, basically a human so that I'm winning faster than a computer. And basically takes g5 here, king f3. I could have even go d7 just to put my passers. d7 would have been better just to throw my passers as far as I can. Basically king e7, his king is so cut away from response and I'm completely winning. But that would have been all what I done in game was also nice. G4 just fixing his pawns. Then KD4. He just can C4 idea. He plays C4 that. This, of course. No, not the only move. KD3 would also work. But he takes C6 here. He takes. And then, yeah. I just add his king away of the pawns. And then promoted a queen. Then started in his pawns. And here Fritz resigned and I won the game. Grandmaster Fritz. Good game. That was a very cool game. I really liked it. Uh, cool, 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 cool. Let's have one puzzle. Please not nightmare. I wish. <laughs> okay. Um. Rook d8, rook c8. Oops. Okay, rook. East. I mean, knight g4 is a cool scene. My rook ain't, so he can play like a 5 or something like this. He can go knight g4 immediately because he can take respawn, but he still has a queen. Uh, if I go for rook e6, he can just take knight g4, king g1, and he's good. If rook d8, he has rook c8. And basically, rook c8, that's fine, I think. And yeah, nothing else. What else do we have? I have. Interesting. F4 is a weakness for him. My rook hangs, so... Like, queen f4, if queen e8 would not be with check, I think queen f4 would kind of win. Yeah, so basically, let's imagine. Uh, queen e8, my king is like on h7, yeah? So queen e8... Wait. Ah, I played like queen f4. My king is on h7, he plays queen e8, knight g4, and he just takes my knight. Okay, <laughs> that wasn't the best example. Okay, um, rook d8, rook c8, knight g4, this is... Rook d8, rook c8, I can just take, take, then king h7, knight g4 idea. And, yeah, maybe it's just rook d8. <gasps> what else does give me the advantage? Wait, how, 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 g6? Okay, in my opinion, that's quite weird. I mean, queen c8, king h7. And, mm, I don't feel that I'm winning. Okay, my nightmare, let's... Oh, <laughs> let's go, it's a nightmare difficulty. Okay. Uh, 
Let's see. Um. Ah, bum, 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 bum. Rook hf3. You can just move bishop away. Uh, I think nothing dangerous. But I mean, I have bishop e5, rook f3. That's kind of winning a pawn. That's kind of dangerous, but <laughs> not so much. Uh huh. Uh huh. What else? I can go for. Uh, like bishop d4 and then rook b3 idea. That seems a bit more scarier. Bishop d4, he goes for bishop c4. Then I go for rook c3 and then rook c2. I mean, definitely I'm rushing, I know, but. Bishop d4, bishop g5. Uh, bishop c2. Ooh, let's go! Okay, I think that's a nice note. I mean, I've fallen Russian so much, I couldn't solve some easy puzzles. Not even 100. I'm... Wait, where am I? I'm 124s. Not so bad. Could have been a bit better if I didn't fail in 2100. Because I fail like 3 and that's basically plus 30. And plus 30, 21, 6, so 2, I would be top 100. So yeah. Uh, but otherwise, it was quite good. So then, I hope you enjoyed the stream. If you didn't, yeah. Thank you all for following. On chess, on YouTube, on Twitch, and as usual, click the button and subscribe to me. And please don't see you. And please make the chess. Love is common. Also, please my Discord. If you'll join my Discord, you'll get notifications when I start streaming on Twitch and when I post videos on YouTube. Link in the description. And yeah, bye bye. Bye bye. Guys. See you soon. See you tomorrow. Same fun. See you all. Stay cool.